Hello and welcome back. Thank you for coming. I hope all is well with everyone. I ordered another move bag and I think it's almost the same size as the first one. I thought it was going to be smaller, but I don't believe so. But anywho, I like it and I'm going to share the rest of my move fabric with you. If you want to see that, come along with me. Thanks for joining me. So the first fabric is going to be, and it's item number 320353 from Mood. It's called the Porsche Sunshine Yellow Smooth Organza. And I got one and a half yards. And this is another Porsche. It's the Navy. I got three organza type material. This is the red. And it's called the Zelda Red 2 ply polyester. Now, the Porsche organza is a lot smoother and, and more flexible than this the Porsche the Porsche is kind of stiff and this the Zelda is more smooth and more flexier than this i think i like the porsche one because it has stability to it and it's more smoother and silkier than the red i have plans to make a blouse out of each of these and um i have a blouse in my wardrobe currently now that's made of organza and it's a beautiful blouse but the only thing about that particular blouse and piece of organza that the blouse is made out of is that it have it's like a border print on that material where these have none. So it's going to be the color and the design of the, the blouse that's going to make it stand out and be the way that I want it to look. I got a couple of ideas. I just love again, so it's a beautiful, beautiful material. Beautiful. So there you have it for the organza. Next, coming up. Oh, and before I leave the organza, the organza is a non-shrink material and it can be washed and dried tumble dry in the machine and because it doesn't shrink you can just go ahead and cut your pattern out without washing it and um, I will probably have mine dry clean or either wash by hand now next is my mob's madra fabric this particular spot right here or squatch right here is my favorite pattern here you can see it better but i couldn't find any and this is like a patchwork material this is how they're making it now and back then too i guess so this is the material that i was waiting to come in it will make it nice dress And it's 100% um, cotton. And it's called Burnt Olive Red and Bluebird Plaid Patchwork. It'll be a good material for the fall color. Okay. Now next is... Now next is this beautiful blue olive and purple poppy cotton lawn and i got two yards of that it's a beautiful 
Make sure you have your very, very light weight and you sort of see through. So if you make a dress out of that, you would have to probably line it. But it's a beautiful, beautiful material. Beautiful. Okay, and I also got some accessories from Wu too that I would like to share with you next. Okay, these are some of the accessories that I got. The Heat and Bond Soft Stretch um, Fusible Web Adhesive to sew with. Next is the Button Gauge and Point Turner. And lastly, for the assess accessories, I got the Sunshine Cuddle twi Twill Tape. I also got some more swatches, which swatches, which I will share with you later. Stay tuned. So now, as I promised, here are the swatches. These here these two here and on this side right here are stretch cotton material they are like psychedelic colors and these two are my favorite they would be nice to make t-shirts out of and mood is calling these the exclusive Romance Stretch Cotton, Alter Ego, and this one here is Moolah's Exclusive Fashionable Late Stretch. I thought they would make good t-shirt fabrics. They are good t-shirt fabrics. These are very beautiful colors here to make a dress and maybe even some leggings. Beautiful colors. And so there, there you have it. I would like to thank you for joining me this week for Friday Souls. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment. Let me know which one is your favorite swatch to make a t-shirt with. And what you think about the different types of organza and what you will make with it. Thank you so much. Bye.